Welcome to my Golden Games and welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2. Whoa, John Marston, what are you doing, man? He's testing his uh, quick draw. Hey, John, how's it going? So this episode, we're going to pick it up that quest that we were doing in the last episode. <coughs> Maybe the episode before. Uh, well, at least it ain't your job. Oh, shut up, Arthur. Uh, oh, yeah, your Sean. job's starting the fight. Anyways, it's a train it. robbery, I what believe. Scrap, Arthur. I'm just no good at home. A different train robbery than that person. I can see. Besides... What do you care, Englishman? You've got no time for me. I tried to find your work, but then you're off cutting jobs with other folks, and your boy Sean doesn't get a look in. Guess I don't want to get shot, that's all. Now nah, you're a real fucking funny shit, Arthur Morgan, huh? <laughs> real fucking funny. Calm down. You better sleep with your eyes open. Yo, yeah, well, you're gonna sleep with your chest open if you ain't careful, boy. <laughs> I love you, Arthur Morgan. I love you. Come on, take a shot. Come on, take your best shot, please, eh? Grow up. <laughs> and let me come on the raid with you. Raid? Don't be playing coy with me, son. It's unbecoming. That bloody train you and him has set up. What you're doing out here, you're going to need guns. You're going to need men. Oh, that. So Marston told you? It ain't a big show. I need calmness. If I take you, I might as well bring Micah along. Now compare me to that oily toward again. You're a dead man. <laughs> Fair enough. Anyway, Arthur, what's your problem with me? In fact, don't tell me. I already know. You are threatened by me. Threatened by you? <laughs> In my youthful vigor. It intimidates you. <laughs> Does it? It's a story as old as the hills. The changing of the guard, the fading of the light. You're toast, old man. OK. And what are you? I'm the future. In all its glory. Yeah, well, good luck. <laughs> That's pretty good. Good luck and shut up. <laughs> I want to get some rest before nightfall. Okay. <clears throat> Wake up, you lazy sir. <laughs> what are you doing here, kid? I'm coming, John. On the job. I said you weren't coming. Yeah, well, Arthur says I am. And it's his party, boy, so come on, let's go. <laughs> Me and the big cheeses love it. Can't wait to slit some bastard's throat. You sure about this? No. <laughs> Are we ready? Yeah. I mean, Train's it is better to have tonight. more men, I would All say. All right, then. It's on. But, uh... Charles? He I'm might ready. be a little over the top. He might, you know, botch our approach. Let's I don't go know. earn some money. I feel like he's, you know, kind of a loose cannon a little bit. Yep. Uh, hey. So, where are we going, boys? All the horses untethered? I think so. Good. They should follow on behind us. Stay on the damn road. Um, find a good spot. Wolf can I not man. bring my horse along? Oh, there he is. Yeah. Okay. Follow the trail southwest. Oh, oh, oh. my bad, my bad. Remote, but should still give him enough time to spot the oil wagon. They see this block in the tracks, they'll stop soon enough. Apparently, picks up a new team of guards at the state line, so shouldn't be too much in the way of guns to deal with. See, this is what I mean. I disappear for a couple of weeks and you cut me out of all the action. Just the action that requires a brain. Ha ha ha. You're a funny fella, John Marston. From what folks say, you had your feet up the whole time playing sick and fondling that new scar like you're going to buy a breakfast in the morning. You don't know what you're talking about. Stay close on this. Wouldn't want you getting scratched by a squirrel or something. That could put you out of commission for the rest of the year. Why do you have to speak so much? It's incessant. They're left here, towards roads. Oh, so I've still got some blood in me veins. You old bastards have forgotten how to live. I blame you two for rescuing them. Far too much trouble for what we got out of it. Yeah, takes a whole army of bounty hunters to bring in Sean McGuire. And look at me now, in the gunner sea. <laughs> Back in business, boys. <laughs> You know, my dad always used to say... Not the dad, no, please. No, this <laughs> again. Fine. Damn you three. Sulky, angry, scared face. A right barrel of laughs. Okay, so, so we're going to... So, we've got the tracks with the wagon, then jump them. That's the plan. Pretty much. Charles, you deal with the engineer. John, secure the passenger car fast, take charitable donations, and make sure everyone behaves. Little Mr. McGuire. Focus on the baggage car. Grab any valuables you can find. Shoot your mouth, get a bullet back. Here's good. 
Stop the wagon over the tracks. Remember, these are innocent folks. We handle this right, nobody needs to die here. Yeah, okay. Let's get it up. There we go. Mr. Marsh, Mr. Smith, Mr. McGuire. Get over there. When she slows, order. And you? I'm gonna make sure she slows. I still want to die with you. <laughs> I like it. Okay. Get moving. So what do I need to actually do? Here she comes. Boy, here she comes. Make that face. quick and join us on there. All right, get on that train. Hey. <clears throat> oh, Foster. Good job, good job. All yours, Captain. Go on ahead. Can I uh, search this guy? No. Nope. Okay. Let's get on the train. Howdy, everybody. Oh. Go. I am everything you got. Money, valuable. Come on, people. Let's go. There you go. Let's make this quick, people. Come on. Let's search the table here. Nothing, dang. What did I do? I ain't got nothing. Want to have a little chat with Romeo and Juliet here? We're all that. Let's move up. What's the problem here? Money. Come on, cough it up, man. Cough up the value. Give it to Thomas, please. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. In the bag, everything you got. Keep it coming, don't be shy. People, Come I on, everybody, let's sick. go. These two seem to think we're playing games. Oh, really now? Cough it up right now. Oh, yeah. oh, God. Let's go. Cough it up now. Thank you. $163 so far, not bad. There we go. Go ahead and look for the baggage car. Let's see, we got anything in here? Nothing, man. Another one here. Yep, give me one second. Everything you got. Come on, man. Give it up. Thank you. Come on, give it up, man. Give it up. Uh, so am I good to do this to everybody? Come on. Thank you, thank you. Don't make me hurt. Who am I supposed to beat up? Oh, nice. Come on, knock them out. People, don't be shy. Everything you Come got, on, let's cough go. it up. Thank you. Okay, so I'm only getting like a dollar for that. That's really doing me no good. So I'm just gonna let him deal with you know, grabbing all the money. You should check on Sean. Okay. Let me uh, get my dual wheeled out here. Everybody, watch out. Move out of my way. Don't try anything what is stupid. It? You all right? Fill the baggage cap. Christ's okay. sake, you ain't even taking a look yet? What's going on? There's probably something in here, Arthur. Oh! Damn! Hey, do it, you all right? Uh, Crap, good? Oh! Reload it, reload it, ow! There we go. You good? All right, let's move up. We got a chest right here. This time I'll look and you provide the cover. Oh, two. Platinum earring. Nice. That'll be that worth some good money. Chance of hitting Kentucky someone. bourbon. Beautiful. <laughs> Very funny. All right, I think that's everything I can take. Uh, let's use my pump action shotgun. Let's get that thing out. Uh, let's see. What do we got in here? Oh, oh. I'm gonna have a really loud look on me head. At least you ain't got a hole in it. Are those tennis rackets in there? 
Just keep your eyes. Fine brandy, where'd I see that? Doing me best, all right. Here we go. That's what's worrying me. We got we got a container here. Got some cabinets here. Let's see, what do we got? Jewelry, nice. Gold pocket watch up top. Sweet. Alright, other side. We got the mail room here. Let's see. Hurry up in there, will you? Money clip. Looking good in here. Okay. Let's see. What do we got in this chest? Come on, we should get out of here. Alright, we got some jewelry. Platinum pocket watch. Small jewelry. Okay, we're good here. Uh, yep, we're good. Okay, what about in the last car? Arthur, we got a problem. There's two assholes on horses. How many you say? I just see a pair of them. Uh, in that case, we're fighting. Horst, Smith, get ready. You men come out the train now, do you hear? We said you men come out now. There's only two of you, you fools. We got a whole lot less to lose. Why don't the two of you ride away? That way neither you get killed. Goddamn liberties. <laughs> There's a few more of them torn enough. <laughs> Big mouth. <laughs> okay, let's deal with them. All right, let me uh, dual wield here. Last chance. Can I? There we go. Why can I not uh, aim it? Then? I have to manually aim it. Watch it there. There we go. Okay. My aim was a little off right there. Oh, we can make a run for it. There we go. Look out behind us! Coming in on horses! Dang, right. Dude, am I out of ammo? Okay, that's not good. I'm running low on ammo. Let's switch to my carbine. Oh man, the sound effects in this game are beautiful. Beautiful. All right, there we go. Good boys. What are we doing? What about the last cart? Pretty sure there was... Uh, we wanted dead or alive. Okay, I'm coming, I'm coming. I'm coming, I'm coming. Where's my horse? Come on. Where are we going, boys? Which way are we going? Let's go. Stay with me. Alright, I guess we're gonna follow the tracks this way. Right, I think we're going in a good direction. Uh, let's see, yeah, we're, we're doing a good job here. Where do we need to go? It's the red is following us. Uh, okay. Whoa! Whoa! Ho -ho! <laughs> that was fun, boys. Real fun. We can see what they call you the professionals in the outfit. Shut <laughs> up. At least we made some money. Hey, what did I get? Gotta be a hundred dollars here. Very nice. You weren't even invited. <laughs> what now? <laughs> we still need a real big tank. Enough for us to get out of here. Was that a setup? Law turned up real fast. I don't know. I don't think so. I'm starting to get nervous. Think they followed us from Blackwater? Maybe. They found me already near Horseshoe, but I think this lot was just locals. I hope so. I'm gonna head into Valentine, see if I can get something started there. Good idea. Either way, we should all go it alone right now. You know the deal. Don't be followed. Uh, of course not, boss. Yeah. Okay. $1,500 take. We got a $206 share of that. Woo! It's a good amount of money. All right, guys, I am going to leave this episode here. This one was a little quicker than the previous few episodes, but I hope you guys enjoyed it nonetheless. Let me know what you thought in the comments below. Have a great day, guys, and see you next time. And be sure to consider subscribing if you haven't already. Take it easy, guys.